Today we're making a ginger pasta with zucchini. It is creamy and it has a tofu for a protein source. And with the ginger, it is just delicious. So let's get started. In a large pot, we're gonna add enough water to cook eight ounces of um, whole wheat pasta. Add a generous amount of salt. When it starts to boil, we're gonna add our pasta. Now I like my pasta al dente, so I'm gonna let it cook for like several minutes. I'm gonna turn the heat down and let it cook. So we're gonna take one zucchini, slice it in half, and then we're gonna make thin strips. You only need half of the zucchini, or you can use the whole thing depending on how much you want to add to it, but that's pretty much what it's gonna look like. Next, I'm going to cut them in half. You'll need one half of a red onion chopped and one quarter of a block of tofu cut into cubes. Pasta is done to perfection. We're going to drain and set it aside. I'm going to mash the tofu with a fork. This is the nice addition of protein without all the fat of regular sources of protein like meat. All the protein and then the fat. Okay, and then we'll set that aside. We're going to heat one tablespoon of olive oil in a large skillet. We're going to add our onion and saute it until it's translucent. I was really drawn to this recipe because I don't eat pasta a lot and when I do I like whole wheat pasta and um, I love ginger and zucchini so to me this this whole recipe just is very nutrient based and tastes so great. I wanted to share it with everyone. So if you have that need for pasta but you don't want to have too many uh, carbs, this is a better option. All right, so we're gonna let that cook for a few more minutes. And we're gonna add just a pinch of salt. It should only take about three to four minutes to cook. Okay, so the onions are getting nice and translucent. And you could actually add a little bit of water, like a tablespoon of water, if they start to stick. Next, we're going to add in our zucchini. And we're going to cook that for about two to three more minutes. We want the zucchini to soften. Doesn't take really um, a long time to cook. And stir it occasionally, of course, so again, it doesn't stick. Now it's time to add in our tofu. Mix it up really well. some liquid aminos and this is kind of going to give it a salty taste so 
just a little bit. We're going to saute that for about two more minutes. You want to stir this up occasionally, keep it from burning. And to constantly keep it cooking. Next, we're going to add our pasta and our ginger juice. We're going to incorporate the noodles with the vegetables and the tofu and all the uh, flavors of the amino acids, the ginger, a little bit of salt. Now we're going to cook this on medium heat until all the uh, pasta is heated through and the liquid has been absorbed. It smells wonderful. So our pasta with ginger and um, zucchini is all ready to go. So have a nice big bowl full and enjoy.